can't be serious. Are you trying to insult me? That car's crap! Let me fix my car up. Then I'll take you. Easy. Fine. It's your funeral. Not much. You? How's your dad? I told you! I got something to get you that chest, alright? You coming out soon? I'll tell you about it later. Pick you up in the corner? Second, huh? I still own it. Hey, you know this guy Wei Shin? Supposed to be Sun on Yi. Every time I turn around, that guy shows up. And usually the cops aren't far behind. Started racing the other day. Talking tough. You think he's a rat? Or on the cover. They had a problem with that a little while back. You think they kill a cop and the police just go away? Sun on Yi's in trouble if he is. I'm 18K. What do I care? But if I was you, I wouldn't let them see you do anything and walk away. This town is full of morons, Naz. It's up to me to put them into place. Yeah? Why? Punk by the name of Ace, talking a lot of trash. Now the fool actually wants to race. No accounting for people's intelligence these days. You gonna take him out? Uh-huh. Motherfucker won't know what hit him. Tell people he's gonna take me down? What? Don't worry. If he races me, they'll be scraping him off the pavement in sticky little pieces. It looks like you have little choice, huh? Inspector, it's way. Hotshot's gonna race Ace. And he's talking like he's not gonna let Ace make it to the finish line alive. Do you know where it went? Not yet. Hey, one other thing. Hotshot and his friend Nas suspect I'm a cop. Nas Singh, the drug smuggler? You know him? Yeah, I know him. He's an informant for HKPD. He's the one that put us on to Hotshot in the first place. <laughs> Fucking guys playing both sides of the game. You want me to tell him to shut up? No. I agreed to help you, Inspector, but not if it gets me killed. Do everything you can to keep my cover intact. I'll deal with Nas myself. All right, Wei, all right. For now, let me know if you find out anything about that race.
This guy wants in, he's gonna have to show me some blood on his hands. You show your true colors tonight, brother. You are an officer of the law. Security company has refused to pay protection money. If you see the vans, hijack them and bring them to one of our garages. Sounds good. I'll grab them if I see them. Me, but who's he talking to? It's the Dai Lo, man. It's the chairman. Wait, you're coming with me. Looks like you're gonna meet Uncle Po. The rest of you, wait here. Don't do anything until you hear from me. What's going on? You 
are staying here like I told you. And you are shutting the fuck up. Got it? Yeah, boss. Of course. Good. Let's go. Pissed off the wrong people, Wayne. Look, at least we kept Siwa alive. Yeah, that may be just what saves us. I'm gonna bump Uncle Paul's cut. Well, when that doesn't, it's not fair, you know? Look what I built. The night market. All the North Point, really. The dog eyes gets green. What was I supposed to do, huh, Liwa? Just what you did. Look, you can't back down from that asshole. You and him got history, huh? Well, me too. Anything, anything happens to me, you look after our people, okay? We're a, we're a family. Family has to stick together. Duke, Conroy, they're good guys. But they're not gonna be leaders. I know Conroy gives you shit, but you've proven yourself now. And he'll see it. Even if he doesn't want to admit it, he'll do me a favor. Look after Peggy and my mom, too. This can be rough business. But one thing we got going for us is each other. Brothers, you know. I know people use that word a lot. But it means something to me. And it should to you too. Not just that we're son on ye. True brothers. Blood. We look after each other. And we look after the people we love. Okay, Winston. See what told me he really works for Big Smiley, not Dog Eyes. I keep hearing his name. Big Smiley is back in Dog Eyes, sure. That's where he gets the balls to come after me. Lee has a lot of power. Along with drugs, he's into prostitution, porn. He even sells women across the border into the rest of Asia. The whole thing is run like an industry. Very sleazy, but big money. Winston, we can't just walk in there. Not if it's as bad as you say. No, we don't have a lot of choice. That's the way it's done, Way. Besides, you can't hide from Uncle Poe. If you want you dead, you're dead. And I'd rather see it coming, you know? You should be okay. But if I get my ass shot, do not do anything stupid, you hear me? Okay. Who gives a shit? Fuck off, Johnny. Hey, Winston. What's wrong? You look a little pale, man. That dog guy tells me you've been throwing your weight around. What happened? You guys used to be tight as shit. Is he here? Nah, he left a while ago. Without a scratch. Doesn't bode so well for the other parties involved. <laughs> Go right in. Have fun. Uncle Poe. Ah, Winston. Come in. Sit down. Have some tea. And you, young man, must be way. Winston speaks very highly of you. Winston has been a good friend to me. I've tried to do right by him. I like the way you think. That's the attitude that makes us strong. Loyalty, discretion. Used to be more common. Winston says you're the one who made sure Siwa was not arrested. No, it was Winston's idea. He had to assert himself. Assert his position. But he... Roland Ho, he has a business collecting debts. The other day he told me that he could use some help. It's, uh...
God damn it. I bet a thousand bucks I was going to be carrying you out in a fucking body bag. Uncle Poe must like you. <clears throat> yeah, I don't think he has an opinion on me either way. All right. I tell you what, you get tired of spinning your wheels in the night market, give me a call. There's more to this business than strong arming street vendors. Ricky, your name's Ricky, right? I appreciate the offer. You know, let me think about it and I'll get back to you. Take the car across the street. Give you a chance to see what it's like to be in the big time. Yeah, you all right? Uh-huh. Things are gonna be okay. There's gonna be work to do. A lot of work. We'll stay ready. I always am. Look, uh, in the meantime, I'm getting swamped with the sweat and crap. I'm gonna need your help on a couple of things. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. I tell you, it's easier to be a Red Bull than a group. I'll stop by the restaurant when you're done there, okay? Got it. Hey, Roland Ho? Who's asking? My name's Wei Shen. Ah, Wei. You got friends in high places, my boy. I hear you and Winston have been making trouble with Dog Eyes. Well, dog Eyes has been asking for trouble. <laughs> I remember when I was like you. Always looking for a fight. Ready to kill anyone who so much as looked at me sideways. Here's a tip for you, kid. Don't take on a boss in your own triad. Unless you know for a fact someone else is gonna back you up. Hierarchy is the only thing anyone cares about. Always have, always will. <laughs> Thanks for the advice, old timer. So, uh, when can we get to work? Okay, big man. Petsy Wing. Bad luck at Mahjong. You'll need this. Collect what she owes. See you later, boss. You're gonna pay up, you understand? Shit, that's a lot of muscle.
That's the problem. You old guy like rolling home money, you gotta pay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry! I don't care if you're sorry. I care if you have the money. I, I don't, I'm sorry! Hey, stop saying that. Sorry! Look. The car! Who has drugs in the back? That should cover my debt. Don't hurt me! I'm sorry! Damn. I wasn't gonna do anything that bad. Best thing though, got a car loaded with dope. All right, I have to do. Bring it back here as soon as you can. Don't drive around in a stash car any longer than you have to. Raymond. Shen, finally. Where the hell have you been? Look, I, uh, Do you have any idea what's going on? What happened at the warehouse? Raymond, do you ever actually read my reports? Your reports? All I have to do is read the goddamn newspapers. They're calling it a massacre. If it ever came out that the police were involved, we're dead. It won't. Well, you can't know that. You at least, you at least could have turned Siwa over to us. It would have helped our case. That would have put the entire operation at risk. What does Penju say? You know, he's not your handle, Way. I am. Well, then fucking handle it, Raymond. Well, how'd you think this was gonna go down? Huh? Whatever it takes. You remember that? You wanted results, and you can't get them sitting behind a desk, nose in a rule book, with a stick up your ass. Look, Raymond, I am doing what needs to be done. No, no, you've crossed the line, Way. I'm gonna terminate this operation. You can't do that. Pendrew won't allow it. Pendrew may like to take chances. I don't. And you are dangerous. Fine. But before you go back to your office to try and pull the plug, go ahead and tell Pendrew that I just met the chairman of the Sun on Yi. The chairman? <laughs> Wait, you're, you're just a foot soldier. Well, this foot soldier has just been marked for promotion because I made sure Suwa got out safely. It'll be in my report. And maybe this time you'll actually read it. Go out for it! 
Yeah, he mentioned it the other day. Congratulations. No problem at all, Mrs. Chu. Hello, Wei. Thanks for driving me around. Yeah, no problem. 
So where are we going? The flower shop. I still have to pick the color I want. He won't believe how much work it is to get ready for a wedding. We've been planning for eight months now, and there's still so much to be done. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, uh, it better be perfect. My wedding has to be perfect. Hey, did you have a girlfriend? <clears throat> no. My life, it wouldn't be a good idea right now. Your life is why it'd be good. You have to have someone you can be soft with too, right? It's very important. If you're hard all the time, one day you'll forget how to be soft. Then... <laughs> if you say so. I do say so. You are family now, Way. I have to look out for you, just like Winston. After the wedding, I'm gonna find someone. So how do you get on with Winston's mother? Uh, she's a handful. But, you know, her bark is worse than that. And I know. How about her meat cleaver? Ha! That's worse than her bark for sure. No, she used to scare me, but then one day, I was having a problem with Winston. He wasn't paying enough attention to me to distract him. And Mrs. Chu gave him a big lecture in front of the whole gang. I thought she might use that cleaver on him. Ever since then, Winston's been an absolute doll. And even though she still yells a lot, I know her heart is well, You're lucky. My mother never liked my girlfriends. I guess it's hard for the moms. Well, I mean, you know, I used to have a thing for blondes, too. And that drove her crazy. Bad enough if I went out with a Chinese-American girl, but a whitey? <laughs> well, it's good to know she was loyal to her people. Don't scratch the paint! She's loyal to her prejudices, more like. That, too? Here we are. I'm here to finalize the details of the flower arrangement. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm just the driver. I'm just gonna change back and then we'll be done. Uh, actually, there is one other thing. Black orchids. This probably sounds silly, but it was my mother's favorite flower. And now that she's gone, I was thinking that I'd love to have a black orchid centerpiece. I'm afraid that's impossible. <laughs> there are none to be found in Hong Kong. Really? Well, I thought they had some down at the Garden Temple. Well, yes, but they're not for sale. The other day, the CEO of Old Boy Trading wanted one for his daughter. He told them they offered Temple $100,000. They still say no. <laughs> it's incredible, no? <laughs> A black orchid at a wedding guarantees that the couple stays together for the rest of their lives. Oh well, Wei, come on. We can go now. All right, next we need to pick up the wedding cake. So you got a cake picked out? Winston's in charge of that. He knows I'm very particular about cakes, but he promised I wouldn't be disappointed. I'm sure Winston will impress me. It's our wedding after all. <laughs> and the wedding has to be perfect. Now you're getting it. Verity, she... You know, she started down a particular road and she get off of it. My mother hoped that moving to San Francisco would shake her up. Change who she hung out with, you know? Did it? Yeah, for a while. But some habits die hard, you know? Some don't die at all. I'm sorry, Wei. Winston mentioned that she passed away. I didn't mean to bring it up. Hey! Isn't that a van from the wedding cake company? Hang on! What are you doing? Yeah, the guy, the guy had the wrong address. Winston asked me to make sure the cake is delivered. He's so thoughtful. Wait, slow down! Peggy, if we don't catch that van, you won't have your special cake at your wedding. What? Faster, faster, go 
Tell Winston I got the cake. Wow, that's great. I'll take it right to him. All done. Oh, thank you, Way. Thank you. You know, it makes me think. Uh-oh. <laughs> the wedding just won't be perfect without that. We're going to the temple, aren't we? I knew you'd understand. family here at all? Uh, no, not anymore. Well, you're wrong, Way. You have family. You have us. Thanks. No, I mean it. I know Winston's work can be rough, but it makes us a family, too. Yeah, I appreciate it. Man needs brothers. Uncles. Sisters, too. To help me with that sauce. Don't laugh. It's very important. You know, I could probably set you up if you want. <laughs> you're a good looking Thanks, but, but I'm not looking for anything serious right now. I wouldn't want it to reflect poorly on you. Ah, uh, uh-huh. You're still playing around, huh? Well, let me know if you ever change your mind. I know some nice girls. Oh my god! Wait here, I'll be right back. Here. <clears throat> when it when energy flows among flowers, we are all everywhere. I, I, I am here and not here. I um, love flowers. Ah, brother, so true, so true. You don't belong here. Uh, what is belonging, brother, when we're all part of the same cosmos? I guess failure is impossible. Who are you? Well, who is anyone? 
when we are all each other, part of a single great organism that never dies. Ah, brother. So true, so true. say no. Peggy, do you have any Winston's clothes in the back? <laughs> I don't think these robes are gonna make the right impression. What do you think about this? Yeah, sure. I guess. Do you like it better here or there? In some ways, I was more comfortable there, but... It was... Thanks for being so helpful, Way. I really appreciate it. Of course. It. Sometimes this wedding thing stresses me out. There's so much to get right, and you only get one try. Don't worry, Peggy. It's gonna be perfect. Oh, it's so nice to find someone you can really rely on. I can see why Winston likes you.
much appreciated. Sheep! This is good. Did you enjoy your time in the States? It was all right. To have two homes is to have two souls. So they say. Well, what if you never feel at home anywhere? Then I think you must guard your soul carefully. So as not to lose it. What would you like to learn? Again, if you find one of my statues. 